Craig, thank you. Caught on camera, a horrifying home invasion in Pompano Beach. Two men with guns barging into an apartment and robbing the people inside. This all happened as the couple who lives in that apartment was going through a spiritual counseling session. Tonight, those armed robbers are still on the run. CBS 4's Gary Nelson is live at BSO headquarters with more on the story. Gary. And uh, these are characters that investigators here in Broward County say need to be gotten off the street. They have demonstrated their capacity for violence and have threatened murder. A little after 6 p.m. June 16th, a white SUV arrives at an apartment complex on Southwest 9th Street in Pompano Beach. Two men emerge and make their way to an apartment where a man and his wife are hosting another couple. One of the men answers a knock at the door and the pistol-packing punks force their way inside. At gunpoint, they force the two men and women into the living room area, making them lie down. What you don't see, because the bandits cut the security camera cord is the four victims being tied up with wire, one of the men being severely beaten, and the home invaders ransacking the apartment. It took about 30 minutes. This is 30 minutes of torture and 30 minutes of complete terror for these victims while they're being held at gunpoint. These thieves made off with jewelry and a large amount of money, apparently knowing the couple in the apartment gave spiritual advice and were usually paid in cash. They had harrowing parting words for the man of the house. As they left, they made a very clear threat. They said that they would come back and they would kill the victim. The couple that lived in the apartment has since moved out, fearing the attackers will come back in this white SUV and make good on their murderous promise. And investigators are all the more anxious for that reason to get these guys off the street. If you can help, the number to call in Broward, Crime Stoppers, 954-493-TIPS. We're live at the Broward County Sheriff's Office headquarters, Gary Nelson, CBS 4 News.